Hi everyone, this is Ray, Design Team Coordinator for Swirly Dudes Kit Club, and I am so excited because this is the video tour of the October 2014 kit, Treasured Yesterdays, and this features the Prima Epiphany Collection, which I think is one of my most favorite paper ever, so I'll try not to get too excited, but let me show you what the paper looks like in the main kit. So this is the first page from the Epiphany Collection, its striking appearance. And this is the back side. This one is Divine Exposure. Notebook paper. Words to Live By. This is a piece that you can cut up for cards or layers. And here's the back side with a pretty light pink somewhat of a damask line there. Manifestation, nope, not that one. Sorry, at this moment. Kind of some graph paper there. Manifestation of love. I love the doodling on here, it's so pretty. And we also have some paper from Blue Fern Studios from the Montage line. This is Society, so kind of bringing out some of those really muted colors from the Epiphany line. Some of the same elements in there. I think it matches up so well. Wisdom. Now and then. and Fairyland. And you also get a piece of specialty paper. This is a resist canvas from Finnebear from Prima. So it's the Elementals. It's one of the new ones. So you can mist and ink away on here. You can see it's got a honeycomb kind of chicken wire pattern. So that is the paper. If you get the paper add-on, you get one of each of these sheets, including this resist canvas. So the next thing is all of the embellishments that come in the main kit. From the Epiphany line, you get nine little roses. These are so gorgeous. They've got some glitter on there, and they really showcase all of the colors on the papers of the Epiphany line. And then we have some cards, the ATCs from the Epiphany line. And you get one of each, I think. So instead of having to buy the whole pack, you get to try out one of every design. Lots of layers, or for cards. More from the Epiphany line stick pins. These are five different stick pins. There's a key, a butterfly, a bird, a clock, and a bird cage. The perfect length, too. And wood icons from the Epiphany line. I'll tell you, these Prima wood icons just keep getting better and better with each release. We've got some little bird cages. You get 24 in this pack. So you get four of those, and they have a nice finish. It's white and glossy, or you can use the backside, make it your own color or just use the wood. You get the same finish on these keys. And then some printed wood icons. So you've got clocks, you get four of those. Four bows. Dream, it's not quite a circle, it's kind of cool and four of these pretty little frames. Again, it's got that natural finish on the back, so you can do whatever you want with them. Also from Prima in the main kit, we have Finnebear Art Ingredients from Prima, of course. These are glass beads and plum. So you can string these, or you can use some gel medium and stick them on your projects. Endless possibilities there. And some Prima crocheted trim. You get a yard of that gorgeous. 
And the last thing that comes in the main kit is some Bluefern Studios chipboard. These are the mini flourishes. So you get four of these. So beautiful. This was probably one of my favorites of Bluefern Studios of all time. I just love them. And that is the main kit. For cardstock add-on this month, we have cardstock from both Basil and American Crafts. There's some black with the texture, some lighter brown, kind of a dark tan, gorgeous coordinating blue, a peach, and a gray. This one has kind of a different finish on there. Looks really cool. So you get two of each of these colors in the cardstock add-on. Next we have our flower add-on and we have more flowers from the Prima Epiphany line. It's got these six flowers right here, again highlighting all of the colors and some with patterns. Some of the smaller flowers from the Epiphany line. These are so cute. I love those little Prima centers, those little pearl centers. Prima on the brain. This is a two-piece set here. This is one piece and that's another. Gorgeous apricot peachy looking. And more Prima. You get these pretty roses and it has a very faint script paper on the lighter of the blues. It's really gorgeous. Coordinates so well. The next add-on we have is our project add-on and this month we are learning all about calligraphy. So I don't know anything about calligraphy and I've never tried it before but I am so excited. We got a whole kit and it's called a master class calligraphy set. So this is the box that it comes in. It's pretty neat. And this is what the content says. You get two manuscript fountain pens, two calligraphy nib sections, 12 ink cartridges in assorted colors, a practice pad, three ruled guideline sheets, and a letter-by-letter -letter instruction manual. So you have lots of good information on how to get started in this little book. And it's pretty thick, and it's written in three different languages, so you get all your bases covered there. And it gives you step-by-step -step on how to make these beautiful letters. I don't know about you, but I'm not always happy with my handwriting for journaling. And I think if I learn calligraphy, I might be a little more apt to add some journaling to my pages. So besides the kit, which I'll just show you what comes in it. It's kind of like practice sheets, like when you were in elementary school. Some thick paper for practicing. This is actually the pins and the nibs and the inks. And then you have enough stuff to make a project. So we have these papers and you get two of them and they're quite long. So it's like scroll paper, just so pretty. It's on both sides. So you have one to practice on and one to make. So you can make your own little scrolls and you can hang them. It comes with dowels and a couple of finials to put on the ends of the dowels and a fancy black velvet ribbon to hang obviously going something like that and some extra little embellishments from Blue Fern Studios these are doodle corners and this is the ornate shelf so lots of fun, endless possibilities there it's going to be really fun to work with Next up is our embellishment add-on. Lots of wonderful things in this. You get two pieces of trim from May Arts. The first one is a blue crinkle ribbon that's wired. So it's a two inch ribbon that's wired, maybe one and a half. Mm -hmm. And this gorgeous lace. And then more things from the Prima Epiphany line. You've got the Say It and Crystals. So you've got some blues and some blacks in there. Some 3D stickers. It's got some cute little jewels in there. These are really pretty. Some cork stickers from the Epiphany line. These are new. I like them. You can color them too. And then you have the ephemera from the Epiphany line. And this is a neat little package. There's all sorts of little things in here, just different little images on these papers. You get 45 pieces. And then there's these cute little things. I didn't take it out of the package yet because it doesn't close back up well. But it's got a butterfly and a little clock and a key metal. It's really pretty. It's a good bargain. 
And then we have some bird cages. Mine are from Fab Scraps. You might get some from Blue Fern Studios. Wonderful little chipboard there. And also from Blue Fern Studios, this fabulous jeweled frame. Isn't that wonderful? I love it. These are some journaling cards from American Crafts. They're chalkboard cut, the chalkboard, chalkboard finish, sorry, with this cute little scribbles and doodling and stuff. And then you get four doilies, four? No, three, from Paper Mania. So you're going to get a gray, a white, and a black one, just assorted ones. And then this is a 12 by 12 corrugated piece of paper from Fancy Pants. And it is turquoise corrugated sheet. Lovely embellishment add-on. And our last add-on is our mediums add-on. And this is from Viva Decor. And this is modeling cream in light blue. It's shimmery gorgeous. I couldn't match this kit any better. And then the rest of the things from the mediums add-on is from Prima. Some brand new Finnebear art ingredients. These are mica flakes in gold leaf. These are gorgeous. They're really large. If you don't like that, you can always crush them up and make them the consistency that you want. Also from the Finnebear Elementals line is this stencil, and it's a netting one, so it's a six and a half by ten and a quarter. Perfect for art journaling if that's your thing. And the last thing that comes in the mediums add-on is the new chalkboard paint from Prima, and this is black. And what it is is an acrylic paint that you can actually make a chalkboard surface out of. So this is going to be really awesome. It has a matte finish. And look at how big this jar is. It's eight and a half ounces. You're going to have this for the rest of your life. So this is our October kit. I hope you get one. If you're not a subscriber, please go to cerulejuice.com and look on the left-hand side of your screen. Click on available kits. And if there's any in the store, they'll be right there and you can get one. And be sure to like us on Facebook. And we also have something new going on. We have our own Swirly Do's Kit Club online gallery for scrapbooking. It's a Facebook group that anyone can join and you can share all of your projects that you make with Swirly Do's kits. Thanks for watching.